Good morning, everyone, and welcome. This is Melissa Arma with the Stock Swishing and Reviewing HPQ. I didn't trade this today, but I caught it in the room. I, I, I'm a stickler for the entry, and it, and it was a little bit late, but it was still a 20 cent stop, so a lot of people did it. And, and, and this actually has a nice target on the day here. It's still going. Targets are $12, 1180, $1175. Uh, this could go to $1150 today, and that isn't, that isn't crazy. That's not a dream target. I did do this last week on the day of the earnings, the day that it gapped, but it was a continuation gap today, and I, and I saw that it would break today to lower the gap, and it did. It was, I had a good eye on this today to see it. I looked at it. I looked at it early, and then I was scanning for other stuff, and then I missed the perfect entry, but I, then I called it here. So the really people that did in the room did it here around 37, 38, 39. Stop is, 20, is 55, 1255. This, this was the perfect entry, though. 47 by 55. Now, that I would have done, but I was looking at other stuff. I should have just kept staring at it. I never thought it would break, like, this early. It, it did, though. It actually broke way before 10 o'clock. It broke at 940. Nice, nice, nice move in HPQ. And, it, and, and it, actually, any this is the high of the day for this today here. This number here, this will hold this, 1261. So anything today this does on any short trade is the short in this today. Targets 12. Low of the day in here right now is 12.10, but I don't, that, that won't hold today. So this is a nice short. And it just goes to show you the power of the gap. Market's rallying today and HPQ is lower. It doesn't matter what the market does if the power of the gap is there. It's intact. Was it? Yes. It was in the day of the gap that happened here, which it fell off a planet. I'll go show you that chart in a minute. This is the day I shorted and it had a great day before Thanksgiving. This day today, I did not do this, but I did call it for the room and then people did it. And I'll tell you, you could watch you could watch every day for follow through of the gaps that I do every day. You could watch every day for follow through of the gaps I do for the ones that work big. And you could watch every one for follow through of the gaps that I do that even the ones that fail. Even when you get ones that fail because they usually continue the next day. When I rate a gap and it raised 20 points or more, they work. They either work the day of the gap or they follow through the next day. It's like gold, people. This is why I named my system the golden gap. Anyways, here was the day of the gap. Open, fell off a planet, shorted it. Had a beautiful trade in here. Got out here. It still went further. And it's, it's even going now. So the low of the day of the gap was 1226. It's now at 12, 1220. But today was a 1210. This is a, this is an amazing gap. This could turn out to be like P, which P had a lot of short plays in it the one month of the 30-day period. This could turn out to be another P. Just watch it every day to short. Every day. Day after day after day. This could continue again another day tomorrow. Don't know where this closes today, though. You can short any any setup in this today is shortable because the high of the day is 12.61, set on the open. If you're interested in the Golden Gap class, it's this weekend, December 5th and 6th. If you want to learn how to trade before 2016, to be with me in the live trading room and trade and get my calls. I'm running an open house this week, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. People were in the open house today. Not a lot of gaps today. Thursday and Friday are going to be the big days this week. If you're interested in the trial or want to come to the open house, email me at melissa at thestockswish.com or if you're interested in the class. Have a great day, everyone. Beautiful HPQ.